The Cajun Outdoors, the whole magazine, the concept of it is to relate to the South Louisiana man. He fishes, he runs trot lines, he baits hooks, he goes for some meat for the weekend. You know, we have hard times, but we still make it work. In Cajun country, we fish soccerly. That's what we after. We're after the soccerly. Our culture centers around the Atchafalaya Basin. It's like heaven out here. When I die, I hope this is, hope this is where I go. You don't see competitive soccerly tournaments that much, or crappy. But we want guys getting involved and getting pumped up to chase this species, because a lot of guys, that's all they're after. They don't fish bass. They go strictly after Sakale, and it gives them something to be competitive in and throw their name in a hat, and they might win some. All the entry fees get paid out. We're growing sponsors with each event. This time we had over $1,000 in prizes awarded that went out to contestants. You know, they had a good time, they fished all day, and we, we cook a meal for them. It's just a great deal for everybody involved. In fourth place, Mr. Bryce Blanchard and his wife, Brittany, with six and three quarter pounds. Winners of $68. Y'all come up, Bryce. Good job, man. Thank you. Oh, you eat those. In third place, Mr. Rufus Royer, and Brandon Foreman with seven and a quarter pounds. Winners of $102. Second place with eight pounds even. Brady, Shortfish Hulan, and Dusty Frederick. And with eight and three quarter pounds in the big fish of the day, for the second time running, Chad Lachale and Terry Caprita. Eight and three quarter pounds, $340. And a first aid injury, steel pit. Team hoop net. Nah, guys, I got it. 340 bucks and big fish. Show that money off for the camp. Hunting season is about to set in. And how you know, we're gonna be wide open doing that. Some guys will not stop fishing these fish, a lot of my buddies included. So we're gonna plan for the next one in the spring. Our first one this year was in June. Now we had a late fall in June. We thought it would have been perfect conditions. Of course, it was a rising river and, and they slaughtered them. It's a guessing game. This weekend we thought they'd slaughter them and they did. But uh, you, you can bet on it that it would be May to June of next year would be the first, and we'll do another one a little later. You'll be able to find the specific dates of the next tournament in Cajun Outdoors Magazine, available at all the Academy stores and over 60 locations, including all the shop rights from Lake Charles to Baton Rouge, primarily below I-10 in South Louisiana, and also on BayouBucks.com.